or a cat or a parrot? Uh, I think the least objectionable of those animals would be a dog. All right. <laughs> Dog's easier to spell. <laughs> yes. Yeah, no. Yeah, no, that's the wrong character. It's better like this. Oh. All right. Hmm. She'll 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 write it out until she's got it. Then she'll start writing it on the paper. Okay. Hmm. So that's good. Just on the bench waiting. She put hers up. She put hers up. Yes. Hmm. I was, well, I was going to ask. Hmm. So what did you wish for? Mm. It's a secret. A secret? Oh. Hmm. Yes, it's Western tradition that secret that wishes that get spoken of aren't going to come true. Hmm. Western tradition. Well, I suppose if it's... Well, I suppose if that tradition is right, then... Yes. Well, good luck with your wish. Whatever it is. Rose is going to go back to staring at his... Going to go back to his paper. He's going to start writing something with Ben Stop. He doesn't know what to wish for. He starts nibbling on his pen. All right, you can kind of hear Satsu go, go tick-tock. Mm -hmm. And uh, it's going to be like, mm. why don't you take Kiriko to tie hers up? I'll just be a minute. Yeah. All right. So you can write in secrecy. Mm. Come along, Rika. Ah! All right. Yes. Uh, but Rio honestly doesn't know what to wish for world domination. Sachiko, what? Sax. Shax suggests yeah. wishing for world domination. Yes. No. <laughs> what? What kind of insane five-year-old wish is that? It's not insane. <sighs> it's megalomaniacal. It gives you good credit back in hell. Has any demon succeeded in conquering the world? Mm. No, that's what makes it a good risk. I see. Aha. Uh -huh. I'm not going to write that down. You're lost. You stupid bird. Okay. Just. Just. Okay. Okay. So. So Rio's going to sit for a bit and finally decide on a wish. He thinks it's stupid, but he doesn't want to keep them waiting. He has to. He has to write something down. So he's gonna write down that he wishes to have. He wishes to make a. Okay, wait. How do how do I phrase this best? Okay. Uh, he wish he wishes that he could make a true companion. Like that specific phrasing, it means something special in Jap. It's a special word in Japanese. Make or have? What is the meaning translated? Not directly, but what do you think yeah. the importance? Means? The importance thing is the importance thing is that like someone that you trust a lot and are lifelong friends with. Are you saying you want a Nakama? Uh it's not that one. It's not that one. Okay. It's not. It's not, it's not basic... more than family friend. Yeah, right? it's not more than family friend, but it's it's like that. Okay. No tomodachi. Daijoubu! Yeah. 
My precious he's Nakama. He's basically writing down that he wants someone that he can trust in, but trust him. I should be, be a Luffy. Yeah, you should be. I want to write <laughs> there. <laughs> is that basically what it is? I want a retainer. Or no. someone to be... Some not I want one, but someone I could feel like could be one. Yeah, not, I want to have that thing. Yeah, without saying I want the position, I want the situation where I would have that position because I trust them. Yeah, he just means like I want someone that I can trust to be really close to me. Just I need my goose. I want my goose. It's just I he, want my like I, said, rank, I want my social rank nine partner. Like I said, he's very undecided about this. When he got here, he realized he doesn't know what to wish for. All right, if you write that down, it will go onto the screenshot. Okay. <laughs> Thanks for clarifying how this works on the last round. Actually, let me just change this writing up. Because, like, the important thing to Rio is that he wants someone that is worthy, not is worthy of trusting him, but he doesn't feel like he's going to betray if they trust him. Well, not betray, <laughs> but like keep something from he him. He feels guilty a lot of the time. He feels guilty a him. lot. When people say I trust you, they're like you shouldn't. But he wants All to right. feel like it's Do you okay. Spend... Do you want to spend your papa? Uh, for what? The intuition thing? <laughs> yeah. yeah. Uh, no. All right. All right. <gasps> mm, okay. The guy was public. What was the average of um, real social links? That's a lot of fours. All right. Or it is. Okay. Let's see what it is. All right. Oh, it's not as low as I wanted. All right. You can all spend your power points to re-roll. No. Keep it close. That's <laughs> not a... Well, if you would rather be low you. so you could re-roll to be higher. Yeah. Not, I want it to be low. <laughs> That's fine. That is fine. Yeah. You open the fortune, and, and it will read... It would read that the world is round. So it's, so you know. It's like, you know, like Spear of Vision is yeah. round. Yeah. But you don't look at it all at the same time because you're only facing in one direction. So it's basically, <laughs> what does it say? it's basically the messages spin around and you'll see everything. Okay. That's what it means by the world is round. Okay. That's... Oh, the earth's flat, idiot. <laughs> it's on the back of four elephants, which swim on a turtle. Yeah, fucking retards. Yeah. That's what I'm talking about, Richard. Alright, so... You will get to the lock charms, and there are several... There are several maidens handing them out, and you'll be able to recognize Katsumi as one of them. Ah, neat. Katsumi is here. What yeah. a surprise. What a surprise. Can you get your charm from her or from some other bit? <laughs> so from her. Alright. And uh, she will hand you she will hand you your to your charm and she will say the traditional Japanese greeting for a maiden to not a stranger but somebody who she is not familiar with. Right. Right. But she'll say it. Well, you don't roll understanding, so you don't know. Uh huh. <laughs> Can to... I choose to roll? I mean, you didn't <laughs> ask me if I could. You just went. She will say, "Oh wait, you aren't rolling. You don't know." <laughs> yeah. You'll have to roll for that. Okay. She is saying it in a warm, friendly, knowing you tone. Ah, warm, friendly, knowing you. Okay. Yes. That's good. That's a good first step. Rio yes. will thank her for the fortune. Hmm. And Kiriko will be like, Thanks, Geisha lady! 
Your size! And goes, Kiriko, she's not a geisha. Looks like one. She does? Does she have the white face paint on? Yeah. Okay. And he'll be like, no, she... And he'll just kind of look at Katsumi and go, uh, well, I should apologize for that. She's just a kid. Hmm. No, it's not a problem. The geishas uh, of the time is there. They hold. They sometimes held vaulted positions. Hmm. And he'll nod and go, "Oh, of course, of course, you wouldn't be offended. You uh, would realize that." I'm simply saying. He says, patting Kiriko on the head. But just fell over. Oh, that's not good. Kiriko, you fell over. She'll get back <laughs> up. No. All right. Okay. So. Oh, Rio doesn't want to hold up the line. But they're over right. like, mm. Well, I hope you have a good New Year's. And he'll just kind of step aside. And then he'll be like, Kiriko, we just said on the way over here, Shrine Maiden, not Geisha. I didn't know they wore the mocap. It's a traditional look. Mm -hmm. Satsuki will be like, uh, um, most of them don't. Is that an Asate thing? Mm. And Rio would have noticed that the other ones didn't. Right. I mean, like, they had, like, varying degrees, but it wasn't as, you know, plastered on. Right. Hmm. And he's going to look back and go, no, most of them don't. Hmm. But, well, you can't fault someone for taking their duties and traditions very seriously, can you? Ah, so they're doing some kind of duty that's so sacrilegious. No, not sacrilegious is the wrong word. That is so devoted to the to the kami is that nobody else knows about it. Right. And he'll just look at Satsuko and then go, hmm. Yes, well, with your many years of religious study, you'd know about all that. And she'll just kind of puff her cheeks and she'll be like, uh, well, I'm third in my class. And he'll go, hmm, third. And I'm a sports major. And he'll be like, hmm, well, that is impressive. <laughs> I believe I remember your athletic score being below average. Hmm. And uh, you, you should have, uh, I don't think we need to go to that milkshake place for dinner. You still got some noodle arms right there. Hmm. And he's going to go. Hmm. Well, actually, I don't even know how to respond to that. <laughs> how would Rio take that? I'm back. Okay. Okay. He'll go and say, hmm. For someone who looked like they were enjoying it, you're sure complaining now. Mm. I mean, you don't want to start it by questioning my knowledge. Mm. Yes. And third in your class isn't really enough to know everything about whatever the people here wish to do for their religious practices. Mm. Well, this isn't some happy clappy temple. Hmm. Bro, it being near the ocean is a bit weird. Like I said, there are some special priests that traveled here. What's this special? Mm -hmm. Never quite... Oh, Mr. Dictionary. You never quite... Uh, you never quite elaborated on that one. I told you my elaboration was to understand the intricacies of it. Mm. Well, Does this look like the kind of place I hang out? Mm. It's your shrug. Mm. You'll be like, hmm. 
Right. Well, unfortunately, I'm not the expert to ask such things, but there are people here who dedicate their lives to this. Hmm. All right. Well, when, when she's done, I'll just walk up and ask her then. Hmm. Right. I mean, look, she's leaving right now. Oh. Hmm. Right. Face a lady! Does Satsuko yell that? Yes. Rio looks disapprovingly. Alright, so Katsuni will go towards Kiriko when she shouted out, Hey, Geisha lady! You mean Satsuko or Kiriko? Kiriko. Okay, I asked Satsuko and you said yes, she said it. I said Kiriko. Okay. I said, she said Kiriko. Are you sure? Yeah, yes. I'm, I'm here this time, Richard. I gotta believe it. I gotta say, man. It's unlucky. <laughs> <laughs> And uh, Katsumi will, she'll, she'll, she'll lower her head and she'll be like, uh, yes, do you need my assistance? And uh, Satsuko will kind of, uh, she'll kind of look the other way and cross her arms. You don't need to roll understanding is that uh, she's bottling out. She's, <laughs> she's chicken. Yes. <laughs> oh, I see. Um... Hold on, I have a macro for this. <laughs> Alright. Yeah, we'll step forward and go. Yes. I'm sorry about that. My cousin here knew that I had a question for you. Oh, mm -hmm. by the way, I should stop the pretenses. Kiriko, this is uh, Nakatomi-san. She goes to the academy. Oh, nice to meet you, Nakamatsu. Nakatomi. Nakatoma? Close enough. And she'll, she'll, she'll nod and she'll be like, uh, it's good to meet you. I, I got a chance. Mm. And this, you'll just kind of, if, if she crossed her arms and like, I don't know, I'm not doing this, Rio will grab her arm and pull her forward, at least for the introduction. This is Satsuko. Satsuko, say hello. Hi. Catching you be like, uh, mm, greetings, young maiden. Mm. Yeah, we'll go. Yes, I thought for the New Year's I'd show them a bit of the town and the academy, and we could go to the shrine here this time for for well wishes and stuff. Mm. Well, yes, this shrine has got a unique atmosphere. It will be my, it's my first time performing the ceremonies in this city. Mm, right. And he's just going to kind of glance sideways at Satsuko with the hint of, well, I'm going to ask then. <laughs> and then go, mm. I can't help but notice that you seem a bit more invested than most of the other people. Invested? Mm, well, you've put more effort into it. Hmm. It's not necessarily a case of effort, though I can understand how some people may get to that idea. No, it's um, due to my, um, let's say, ranking within the... Within the I'm just going to say clergy, because I don't know the Japanese term. Sure, within just go with it. I don't know, order, whatever. Yeah, order, something, whatever. Just go with clergy, whatever you're comfortable with. Find out what you mean. G. G. Yeah. That's G. <laughs> but if she says it, if she's, she said it, if she says it like clergy, I think of corgis in priest outfits. <laughs> okay. but, but clergy, though. Yeah, yeah yes. I know. Okay. Oh my god. Hmm, I'll be like, hmm. Hmm. In other words, uh, I am the senior shrine maiden here. It is a female dominant position, though when it comes to the monks, that's an entirely different sect. Senior shrine maiden. Wow. Okay. They're old! 
Okay, 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 we'll go like, wow, so you control every, every girl here? And Ketsu would be like, uh, not quite, but uh, I do give my input as to how how the dances go. <laughs> oh, you dance? Wow. So you're like a ballerina? Mm. It's more to do with placement rather than... Mm. More tr traditional dance. Mm. Right. Hmm. You performed that, huh? Hmm. Yes. I've. Uh, I do perform the kagura here. There will be one in the evening to to mark Amaratsu's passing. She seems to have graced us today. And she'll look towards the sky. It's very sunny with the glimmer of snowflakes. All right. We all look up for a moment and then go, hmm. Well, that certainly seems very, that certainly seems like a nice practice, don't you think? You'll say looking down at Kiriko, everyone help you like. Yeah, dancing's really graceful and you become all girl-like. And then, especially if long hair and it flows and it falls in the night sky. How poetic. And Satsuko will be like, oh, that's uh, pretty important. Oh, uh, uh, do you have time to talk to us? Don't you have like big duties or something? And Katsumi will be like, one of my duties is uh, talking with the members of our community. Mm. Right. <laughs> but if you do have things that you should be taking care of, uh, we don't mean to keep you. Hmm. No, I've uh, I've finished my rounds. I've been sat there since the morning hours. I could do with uh, some stretching. Hmm. Some stretching. Hmm. Well, I was just going to kind of lock at his cousins and be like, hmm, if it's not too much trouble, do you think you could point out a nice place? Well, not a nice place. Do you think you could point out a place that we could sit down? We've been around most of the day anyways. Hmm. Yes, uh, there are some shaded areas outside. Unless, uh, unless you wish to tour the temple itself. But if it's just for temporary relief, uh, well, we do have the gardens over here for more quiet contemplation. So hmm. if you're not in the quiet mood, uh, I can take you on the tour to the temple itself the caves can be quite uh, amusing for conversation mm, right what do you girls think caves <laughs> looks at Sachiko you choose she's, she's looking down alright I'm gonna roll my understanding <laughs> yep I don't get her what is with this girl <laughs> Fucking women. <laughs> and he'll be like, mm. well, that sounds interesting. I don't think I've ever seen them. Mm. Mm. Yes, well, given that we're on the ocean front, the terrain around here is quite spectacular. It makes our duties a lot more mm, pleasant aesthetically. Hmm. Well, what do you think about a little stroll down to the seaside then to see these caves? Yay! Yay. All right. She will, uh, she will take you along then. And uh, you'll, see the, you'll see the cool bits of the temple rather than the informational bits. All right, good. And Kiriko will do the echo, 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 echo. Mm hmm mm hmm Echo. She won't take you to coffee in place. Good. I'd be <laughs> concerned if she did. We would have had to have words about Kitsume. Why did you do that? Why? That was irresponsible. All right. And uh, Satsuko, she's, uh, she, she's, um, she's fascinated by the place. 
like you don't need to roll an understanding to see that uh, she's taking this very seriously. Oh, good. She she's enjoying it. I don't get that. You don't. You don't understand why it's. Yeah, I don't now. get. I don't get why. I know. I see that it is. That's good. Quick, get girl someone is on the case. Get someone you can trust. Get Akira on the case. Okay. No, Hamada. He's the best at finding out what little siblings do and not telling you. Yeah. Lude. <laughs> Disgusting. That. All right. So so obviously you you can sit within the caves for a break. Okay, sit down. Okay, if there is a time, which I assume there is, Rio wants to have a word with Katsume. All right. Okay, going up to her, and he'll be like, "Uh, as pleasant as this is, I'm afraid that there's some business I need to do." So I was hoping I'd get a chance to speak to you today. Business? I assume of the academy type. He'll nod his head and then go, yes, but it's not a request or informing you of anything. It's, I suppose you could say it's more personal business. Should I, I... call for, should I call for a maiden or a mother to provide entertainment? Mm. He assumes she means that for the girls? Yes, you can assume that. Okay, I can assume that? Alright. I mean, yeah, unless Rio's really fucking paranoid. Okay, good. No, he's not really... F he, he, he's, he's had an okay time today. Satsuko's being a bit weird, but whatever. They're, they're having fun. He'll be like... Paranoid about women's true intentions. Yes, exactly. And he'll be like, oh, hmm. Right. Well, I don't mean to impose on anyone's time, but yes, bless you. I don't mean to impose on anyone's time, but if you could, I suppose I'd appreciate that. Not All I right. suppose I would. So she'll just kind of clap her hands and they'll be whisked away. Whoa, how efficient. <laughs> it takes a bit a longer tight, than that, but you know. They're on a tight ship around here. Jesus Christ, magical teleportation. <laughs> Okay. Are they with a cat now? Oh yeah, you're in the cat. Haha, <laughs> I'm God. Yeah. Alright. Just yeah, we'll go. Alright. Yeah, we'll go. It's nothing too important, like I said, but it is the kind of thing that's done. And it's just going to go and give her a small bow and go. For all the assistance that you've given my friends and myself this year, I'd like to thank you. Even though we might not have had too much uh, time to get to know each other, uh, everything that you have shown me shows me that you're a good person, but I'm glad we know. And he's just going to kind of take an envelope out of his pocket, and it is the present for her. You remember mm -hmm. what that is, right? It is the tickets. And he mm. would say, I thought you would be able to appreciate this. All right, and uh, she'll uh, she'll take the ticket. She'll take the envelope, and before and she'll, before she'll open it, she'll just kind of close her eyes and she'll shake her head and she'll be like, uh, "I believe I'm having a sense of deja vu, or got a kin, uh, a similar sort of conversation that we've had before." But still, I I will I will accept your uh, I will accept your uh, not compliments. Mm. And he'll go, he'll pause for, I think she meant not compliments, like, I know these are totally compliments, but I'll preserve oh, your honor. Okay. I thought this was okay, oh, my bad. Not the word compliments, but, right. you know, yeah. similar kind of word. Similar, okay. Great. And he'll just kind of pause for a moment as he thinks, but then he'll remember, oh yeah, that stupid thing I did when I was really paranoid. He'll just kind of rise up and go, <laughs> well, this one, it's quite all right for you to open. A gift for the winter season. I hear it's very traditional these days to give such things. All right, she'll open up the envelope. Okay, I know, exact, I know right, exactly what plays it it's for. What is it for? Okay, I know exactly what plays it's for, and I named the theater if it is. You named the theater? Yes. Ah, uh, uh, because I'm a huge weeb. 
Uh, Ryo's favorite place theater is for Showa Fukugen Gaijutsu Gekijo is the full name. But you can just call it Gekijo. Uh -oh, which okay. means theater. Which stands for the Showa Restoration of Arts Theater. Which means they do old plays. Okay, I'm just opening up. I'm opening up your thing now. That black is... Like, you tried to do a text color, didn't you? And it turned nope. it up. Nope, Why I is didn't. it this black? Uh, that is... I know, right? I know. Huh. That's weird. I know. Huh. Wait, what are we looking at? Is it... Isn't the text slightly bigger? It also. is. See... Now, did you write that, like, on this page, or did you paste it from somewhere else? Uh, this... this here? Yeah, the GIFs. Yes, I am aware that it pasted in the wrong size, because I did have it written down somewhere oh, that, else. Oh, that explains it. Then, yeah, it pasted in different size and thickness, and that's why... Yeah, it yeah, okay. it, it keeps... For, it, for, oddly yeah, enough... Yeah, yeah, yeah. Even though Roll20 doesn't let you pick the formatting text size... Oh, it does you completely them. import it. Yeah, no, it's amazing. Yeah. It's okay, incredible. That that's how I did the tables for the social links. Yep. yep. All right, that explains everything then. Cool. Yeah. It, didn't, <laughs> it didn't import the text, though. It just did the, the table uh, colors. Hmm. Uh -huh. Hey, you know. <clears throat> it's whatever anyway, you don't expect it to do. You spent yeah. 20 XP on that. Hmm? Yes, I did. Massacre! Hmm. Massacre. So she won't take it all out, but you know, like, there's, like, a heading at the top of it? Yes. Kick it. A heading at the top. And she'll just kind of, uh, she'll look at it for a bit, and she'll be like, uh, you know of, uh, you know of Gekijo? Gekijo? And he'll be like, oh. <laughs> uh, the Baha, sorry, I needed to catch my head. Uh, he'll be like, oh, yes, I'm familiar with it now. I haven't had the pleasure of being myself, though. Myself yet, though. It does look interesting. They have a number of performances that I was interested in seeing. And he'll just kind of fidget for a moment and then go, it's how I found out about that specific showing. You never told me what the showing was, by the way. Yes, it is the play of the, the Takasago, which is a real Noah play. I, I need to roll knowledge for Katsumi, would she know? I, it's one of the most, it's the most famous modern Noah play there is. Okay, she, she'd know. And she'll be like, uh, ah, I see, that's, uh, that's quite the classic that we've chosen. I do believe that uh, coming up near to the end of the year that you'll be doing, there'll be a short uh, work placement. Uh, it would be nice to see whether I could understudy there for Mm. And he'll just remember the school play, the Christmas one, and it was it was good for the parts he was able to watch. And he'll go, hmm. "Well, I'm sure you'd be able to get a part. After all, you did bring the entire temple there for your performance." Mm. Well, yes, he doesn't say yeah. that. He says your performance did bring the entire temple out. And she'll just kind of smile as if she's remembering the moment, and she'll be like. Uh... Yes, I was not expecting that. Hmm. Well, I don't see why not. Anyways, he just kind of brushes that off and then goes, Anyways, it's not too much of a classic, but, well, I figured you'd appreciate the main event. Truth be told, the reason I found out about it was the after part, was the after show. Ah, I see. The after show would be a playing of the, the Rakugo play called the Shinigami. Hmm. And uh, she'll be like, uh, well, I'm honored that you would, uh, you would have your first view in me. And he's just going to kind of blink and go, my first viewing with you? As in, you said you haven't been to the theater before here in Asate? Oh, yes. No, I hadn't. No, no. I was intending to find a show to watch when I came back. After all, it does seem like quite the lovely place. So I'd like to see what it's like there. And he just kind of pauses and goes, uh, 
I think you might be misunderstanding. I found out about that play, but... Well, I figured the tickets would better go to you. You'd be more able to appreciate it. Ah, so, right. I suppose that's where your efficiency comes from. And he nods and goes, Yes, so I didn't procure any for myself. Oh, I see. <clears throat> so, that's quite the same. Are there two sick tickets in there? Yeah, of course there are. It's boring to go to a play yourself. And she'll just be like, uh, mm. I am a person of my word, however. I would like to take you along with me. And he'll just... Okay, I need, to, I need to... Let's see. Diligence. Five? Okay, that's tech. That's on the low side. But it's in the middle low. Okay, so Rio will go... I mean, Rio wants to see the play, so he's not turning. He's not going to turn her down. But he'd be like, "Oh," he just pauses and go, "Well, if you can't think of anyone else you'd like to take, it's your prerogative who you give the other ticket to." And she'll smile and she'll be like, uh, "No, I can't think of anybody else," and she'll say that confidently. Mm. <laughs> <laughs> Fuck. Okay, then he'll go. Well, in that case, I won't do you the dishonor of refusing. Mm, right. And when's the date? I of figured it day? would... I've, uh, you can decide. I figured it would probably be the weekend after they get back from school. All right. So let's say decide, Saturday though. evening. Yeah. All right. Okay. And your wish came true. Ooh. Right then. Well, since this is the gift that you've given to me, I can give you your ticket on the night, then. Hmm. Uh, and he'll go, right, then. I'll clear up my schedule, so I'll clear up my schedule and look forward to it expectantly. Hmm. Right. And to be like, uh, I wasn't able to get your home address, so I sent it to your dormitory post box. Oh. Oh well, that's not. I imagine. Fun. I imagine there would be a backlog of uh, a backlog of, of mail. Mm. So I uh, apologize for the inconvenience. And he'll go. Oh, no inconvenience at all. I suppose thinking on it, it's only natural that at this time of year such a thing would be built up. Hmm. I guess I didn't really tell anyone my address. Still, I I appreciate this gift uh, greatly. I did not know that you thought of me in this way. <laughs> okay, he's going to go. Hmm. I can't really see what other way that I can think of you. After all, when looking over them, for a gift, it seems perfectly fitting, doesn't it? I mean. Truth be told, I don't know very much about you, but I know that you're dependable, respectable, you have an interest in the... enjoy the arts. And he'll just kind of shrug and go, ah, Personally, I was afraid that it would be somewhat lacking in the personal touch. Hmm. And uh, she'll just kind of close her eyes as if she's contemplating. And she'll be like, most people see me as the maiden Nakatomi, so most gifts that I get are well wishes, or of the religious nature. It's refreshing to see that my student side has been recognised, and I suppose out of all of the people that I've come to know in the academy, it is a most appropriate gift coming from one of the two first years who appropriate the council. Hmm. And he'll just kind of nod and then go. When it comes to side, I must confess, I'm solely focused on the student side. He'll just kind of look around the ta cave for a bit of and go, Truth be told, I still find it hard to put my head around the fact that you live here. I'm sorry mm -hmm. if I'm not showing you the proper respect for that thought, for those thoughts. Mm. I'm very much accustomed to 
a varying amount of uh, reactions. It is, uh, I guess, it's not normal for a shrine maiden to to moonlight as a, I would say, ordinary student. But in my academy, is anything but ordinary. Hmm. Right. Anything but ordinary. He'll go. Hmm. Katsumi right. doesn't watch anime, clearly. Of course she doesn't. Rio doesn't watch... Rio doesn't watch it actively. So, you know. Act like, How does he watch it passively? Passive anime Because he watching. doesn't. He doesn't watch it actively. No, he watches because... it passively. Yeah. yeah it's... Passively. Yeah. I'm yeah. not watching you, Bakuna. Bakuna. Yeah. He just absorbs enough for osmosis of day-to-day -day life. I mean, it's Japan. Yeah, you know. <laughs> All right, or are so. you a child? Yeah, so he'll be like, mm, right, well, I mean nothing disrespectful about it. He just kind of goes and says, so I'm s so... Hmm. He just kind of pauses and goes... Truth be told, there was something I was wondering. But I suppose borders on the Shrine Maiden part. Mm. What is it? When the New Year comes, do monks and mikos also tie their wishes to the trees? Of course. We are, even, we are a part of the people. We just have different guises that we wear. Hmm. And he goes, ah, I see. <laughs> I suppose somewhere in my image of it, I think, separate from that. Well, that's very glad to learn something interesting mm -hmm. today. Well, at the end of the day, we're all we're all influenced by the kami. There is there are no, uh... <sighs> and she'll just kind of shake her head. And she'll be like, uh, we're taught that there are no differences between people. In the in in the true teachings, the ones that stem more from Buddhism, but it is you can understand how some well wishes are detached from the reality. Mm. Right, right. Of course. Do you want a real understanding? Yeah. Okay. That was kind of.